Welcome back to another episode of Things That I Ponder <laughs> While I Wander <laughs> Over Yonder Here we go again I come up with a couple more things that I ponder while I wander over yonder <laughs> Well this is a good one Now I'm up in Canada But do you ever see people marketing foreclosure sales? Sign up now for a list of all the foreclosure sales in your area. Well, here's the thing about Canada and our banking system. There's no such thing as foreclosures. We have powers of sale, but they're incredibly different than what you see on television. Today, I want to talk to you about the difference between American foreclosure sales and the Canadian system where we use a power of sale. In America, banks have the opportunity to take over possession of a house if you miss a payment or miss payments and they foreclose on your home and then they can resell that home for pretty much whatever they want. And it sounds like a great deal. In Canada though, we do things differently. We have power of sale. And that gives the bank the right to take possession of the house but not the title of the house. It gives them the right to sell the house to recoup their losses, but they can only do so with certain conditions. One of them, and the most important glaring difference between our system and the American system, is that they have to try to sell it for market value. So while in the States, they can sell a home for $20,000 if that's all the bank is owed, in Canada, they have to sell the home for whatever the home is worth at the time. And the bank is then allowed to take the money that they're owed, but they have to give the rest of that equity back to the original homeowner. And that's what the big difference is between foreclosure sales and powers of sale. We don't have foreclosure sales in Canada. Well, it might make you wonder. Well, didn't I just see an ad foreclosure list? Sign up today to be on a list of recent foreclosures. Well, you see signs on the side of the road encouraging you to get in touch with the realtor because they have a list of foreclosure sales that you could take advantage of. Well, if there are no foreclosure sales in Canada, what are you taking advantage of? Or a better question might be, who is being taken advantage of? because you just signed up for something that doesn't exist. The moral of my story is that there are no foreclosures in Canada. There are powers of sale. And if you're signing up for lists of foreclosure sales, you're signing up to be on somebody's marketing list. If you want true, honest service without any trickery or tomfoolery, send me a message. And if you want more content like this, drop me a like or do something, whatever it is you're supposed to do. I still have no idea. Thank <laughs> you.